Hey people, how are you doing today? So today we are going to uh, unbox this Chevric uh, camera mount which I got it from Amazon. Uh, it is triple nine rupees and compared to it is same like Moto Wolf and uh, so there is no difference. I also have a Moto Wolf if you watch my vlogs and if you watch my handlebar then you will know what I am talking about. I also have a uh, same thing but it is a mirror mount. So I know what is the difference. I find there is no difference at all. It is same, exactly same. Moto Wolf and Chevrolet are same. So this is what you get inside the box. A thank you letter and then the camera mount, and uh, then you will also get a keychain. Uh, this is the ball joint which you will have to install it on a rod, and this is the ball joint for installing the camera. And then you also get a keychain, and then another thank you letter. That's it. These are the things which we will get inside the box. Uh, now we will go ahead and test it on our uh, Himalayan BA6 2021 bike and let you know how it works. Okay? Thank you guys. Please stay tuned. You will get a camera mount that is the ball joint and then the extender and then two U bolts and then the camera mount itself and a keychain and bolts and spanners and everything is included. Come on, guys. Let's install it on our bike. So, guys. So guys, uh, now we will go ahead and install this, okay? So this is what we get inside the pack. And uh, we will remove this. I think for the rod which I have, I need the smaller one. This is bigger one, this is smaller one, so I need smaller one, okay, let's see how it goes, so these are the things I have taken, let me see how it goes, I wanted to install it, this side, yeah, I think the smaller one suits well. Usually I don't like to do it myself but this is the first time ever I'm doing it on my own hopefully this is a success hey, I've installed one bolt and now we have to install the other one I'm just keeping it on the cross. Okay, now it is done. Let me show you at the end, okay? Hey guys, now I have installed it. This is how I have installed. I hope you see it. Okay, I have uh, tightened it. It is hope it is solid let me mount some camera let me mount my camera to see how it is it is already vibrating i'm not sure how it is going to withstand uh, this one let me see okay hope you see how i have mounted this bolt this one this one okay this is a simple dy process this is a simple process you just have to remove this remove this like this and then install it and then tighten it as per your setting okay let me test this uh, mount and see how it performs so guys actually i have mounted it uh, this way and uh, it seems to be shaking a lot the vibration is lot if i keep my phone in there it's going to be really tough for this uh, for this GPS mount to handle. So I'm not sure how stable it will be. So this is how I have mounted. Bro, nothing will happen, no?
No, it started vibrating already. I think it will vibrate. What I feel is, right now the problem is uh, not with the camera mount, the problem is with the uh, GPS mount, okay? It is not a problem with the camera mount. The camera mount is strong, rock solid, okay? So what I feel is right now the problem is not with the problem is not with the camera mount it is with the with my GPS mount the camera mount is rock solid okay I would recommend you guys to go ahead and buy it if you want it okay thank you so much guys thank you so much for watching Gemini Motor Vlogs have a great day bye.